Only missing its front left leg. I think we did it. Whoa. Hey, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Wobble Dog Wednesdays. How's everyone doing? Another Wednesday means another Wobble Dog. Digsby's gonna become a new woman, man. Woman. Dog, wobble dog. Flamingo is hungry and is evidently not happy about it. Are you shoving your face into the floor? It's like that thing kids do in road trips where they get frustrated and so they just cross their arms and point their face at the window. Eat some poop. <laughs> like get up from the seat and try to move as far away from you as possible. Like, hmm, but their <laughs> seatbelt still pulls them to the seat. I love the road trip vibes. Digsby. I literally, even though it just happened, I already forgot that you, like I mutated you. I was like, oh, Digsby? You're so cute. You're so dang cute. All the default dogs are like precious, precious boys. So last time, if memory serves, we aimed to get Lunge and Protractor X, star-crossed lovers, to leg as much long as possible. That sentence just kind of crept out of my mouth and I wasn't ready for it. Protractor X, let's let's move to the cocoon phase. You too, lunge. Okay, someone took exception to something. Awesome, okay. So those cocoons are gonna produce Cresselia. Where'd you get the scaff? That's not good. And the idea is that hopefully, oh, one's already done it. They'll latch on to these um, genes and turn them into the plus variant, which makes them more effective. And that's exactly what we want. So we're just gonna let that do its magic. Clom Thursday, the dog, I always forget I named it that. You have a wacky name and I love it. I love wacky, you're, you're leaving me like everyone does in my life. So I have a story from my chemistry lab today. If you don't know, I'm currently studying chemistry in college. I'm in my second year and that's why I've been so dang busy all the time and have a hard time uploading multiple times a week is because I'm a full-time student. I'm taking four classes. And one of those classes has a lab portion. Organic chemistry too has a lecture and a lab. And I had my lab today. I have it on Tuesdays and I record these videos on Tuesdays so they can be ready on Wednesdays because it's Wobble Dog Wednesday after all. I guess that means for me it's Wobble Dog Tuesdays, but for everyone else it's Wobble Dog Wednesdays. I'm sure this news is very upsetting to a lot of you. But anyway, I went to my lab and they last like four or five hours. It's a long time. And of course today, me and my partner, we were the last to finish because our machine wasn't working. One of the first things they tell you in like lab safety in chemistry is like if you have to test something for odor or scents, you don't just jam your nose in there and go like you that's that's how you get high or die you're supposed to waft it gently at your face like just waft just to waft the fumes with your hands you are so dang cute digsby look at his little march i feel like this is gonna sound weird but i imagine this paired up with the like you just lost a race song from mario kart wii but yeah so that's like one of the first things they tell you in lab safety that you have to sign off on i guess my partner just like missed the memo on that because we were making uh esters we were doing esterification and if you don't know what esters are an ester is a functional group in organic chemistry and it's basically pretty much all like artificial flavorings and like scents and stuff like that are esters and we were making the ester that is banana scented sounds fun right it wasn't it took five hours and was horrible but at the end you get something that sounds like incredibly concentrated artificial banana and at the end it's like and and, and waft a little bit to like see if you can smell the banana and my freaking partner just jammed his nose in the beaker and went and then like had to leave the lab because he was feeling like woozy it was it was a journey, but he did confirm that it smelled like banana. So I guess it was a mixed experience. Everybody's doing really well. Let's check in with everyone one by one. Russell Bustle B has one of the fattest disparities in leg length that I've ever seen, especially width. Width is what I meant to say, leg width. That is definitely a good and comfortable place to sleep. We've got two absolutely thunderous and juicy back legs followed up by a couple of twigs in the front and i respect it your face is vibrating a little bit i guess i also respect that as well glonathan is a uh glonathan is trying to rip someone's leg off but also is very cute and looks good doing it who's getting harassed right now chunsty okay well normally i'd say stop but chunsty you're well aware that glonathan is just unapologetically my favorite speaking of Go crazy, Glonathan. Flamingle is having an absolutely grand time with ants on a log. We, I, I think we can all say we've been there. Isn't that right? Your face is tiny. Chunsty has every problem. Here, eat this gourd. Eat this gourd. We're a little low on food in this room. I'm gonna make some, I'm gonna make some churros. I'm gonna make some tubes of concentrated pizza because everyone loves those. All right, Glonathan, come on down. I hope you didn't change that much because I love your look. Oh yeah, Glonathan changed a lot. Legs got longer and he got paler. That really bums me out. The role of favorite has transitioned to Digsby now. Look at you. 
little guy. Also kind of violent. Why are they all so confrontational? Why are all my favorites so mean? Maybe they can tell they're their favorites and it gets into their head. Lunge, eat this nutrient thing. Oh, wait. I wasn't supposed to do that. I was supposed to give it Priscilla. Shoot. Okay, well, look at this. Look at how densely packed Lunge's gut is. This is like insane. Protractor X. I'm gonna expel you, and then we're gonna eat some cocoon, okay? Okay, and now we hope that these bind to the orange ones and not the yellow ones. One of them hit a yellow one that sucks, but... Oh, one just did. Two just did. Fantastic. Lunge, where did all your special goodies go? You little goofball. What are we doing? Oh my god, we're supposed to be your bored as hell. I feel that, mister. I had four classes today. No, I didn't. I had one. I had four classes yesterday. I don't know why my brain said that. I'm gonna pet your tail. I don't know how that's comfortable for you, but apparently it is. I'm gonna pet Chunsi's tail too. That's how my dog in real life, that's how his tail is. He has a tiny little nub tail and I love it. It's so cute when he wags. Look at that. I love my friends. Things are going well for the community. Oh my God, so many dogs can breed. Okay, we need to keep the wings alive. So I'm gonna breed Flamingo. And I guess Chunsty. I forgot we need to keep this like wing thing going from generation to generation. Ugh, okay, no wings on this one. Maybe the, maybe the next try. Please, come on. I don't want to lose the wings. Nope, still nothing. Ugh, getting worried. Still nothing. Oh my god, dog pile. Literally. <laughs> I'm so sorry, everyone. Flappy wings, big happy flappy wings, happy flappies. Any happy flappies about? Wait, 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 was that dog missing its front left leg? Aww. Wait. That's that's missing its front left leg. That's missing its front left leg. Look, it's got it's got two in the back and it's got one in the front. That's the right. Oh my god. Finish. It, it, it doesn't have the wings, and that was our original goal. But this is an achievement that we have been trying to get for so long. I'm hatching this guy immediately because I think he's missing. It was front left, right? Not front right. Bit more wobbly. Only missing its front left leg. I think we did it. Okay, please. Please tell me I'm not like insane for thinking this. Oh, I, I beg. I truly beg. Okay, lunge. We're gonna we're gonna put them in the cocoon area because they keep eating the things I don't want them to eat. There we go. We're gonna do that. Oh my god, did you freaking puke again? <gasps> Wait, Lunge lost all of his gut flora. What happened? Not even just like a little of it. He lost all of it. I've never seen that happen. Oh my god, they're gonna mutate together. That's really sweet. Well, that was, that's a bit concerning. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Please, please tell me. I did it. Oh my god. I, just, I, I have the little exclamation point. You, you are so crucial to this playthrough. I hope you know that. I love your Perry the Platypus tail. Snary the, the plup. Snary the plup. Snary the plup has granted me the a bit more wobbly achievement, which gives me a noble dog statue. There's our centerpiece for our freaking garden. We were building a garden last time. Oh my God, this is huge. Oh, so noble. Boom, that's our centerpiece. Incredible. How perfectly timed is that? And I love these guys just hanging out in the tree. What fun fellows. All right, lunge, you're up first. Oh, your legs look long. That's good. The leg length is improving. That's nice. The bars are filling. Protractor X, it is your turn. Also got some longer legs. What? Why did the leg go down by 37%? Front bottom leg. What the hell? After all I've done for you? Okay, well, you guys are gonna hang out in the cocoon zone until I figure out what that that is about. Okay, let's give it another try. Um, finding wings because we need to do that. Let's do it with Russell Bustle B this time. There we go. We already got wings. Thank goodness. We're keeping the wings alive and we're back to 10 dogs. We haven't been at that in forever. Not even with ghosts. Like we hit 10 last week with some ghosts involved. Now we just have 10 separate dogs. It keeps sending me down here and that's not ideal because I don't know how to get like back up, up a level. Our winged dog is going to go in the space room. Eh from downtown. Oh my god, sniped. That is awesome. Chunsty, I was about to say that I need to feed you, but then you took matters in your own hands. Same with you, Digsby. Look at everyone feeding themselves. What is this new era we've entered where dogs can eat when they need to eat? It's madness. Oh, ate too much and I sleepy. <laughs> Relatable. Oh, lunge is stressed. Lunge is stressed, so I'm gonna pet lunge. I'm gonna clean this puddle you're in because... That might be why you're stressed. Man, lunge, like, where did all of this go? Where did all of the OX1042 go? Protractor X. Oh my God, lunge is like nervous eating. Okay, we're gonna put you outside and we're gonna put the other one in there. I know I'm separating the lovers and I feel terrible. We just have all this Cressilia hanging around now with nothing to do. Digsby's ready to mutate. Okie pokes. Digsby, Digsby, Digsby. Come on, Digsby. Precious boy. You're so precious. Doesn't even matter that nothing really happened because I love you. Russell Bustle B is getting old. Oh, well, that's not very fun to think about. That is definitely not poggers. Am I, am I right, 
Today's youth. Protector X, you're surrounded by food. How are you this hungry? There you go. You literally barely even had to reach. So what happens when your gut is this full? Does stuff just like randomly get deleted? I have no idea. I wonder if stuff like glutton and like personality traits get passed down. Oh, it's the scaff. The scaff is ruining everything. Can you stop eating poop, Lunge? It is totally messing with my deal. Lunge, you need to eat just this. This is what you need to eat. Good. That's what you need to eat. Absolute goofball. Can you believe this guy? Look at our happy community. I haven't seen it this fun and happy in a while, and I'm just so pleased. Who needs to play? Clom Thursday is so bored. Tummy rubs, tummy rubs, tummy, tummy, tummy rubs. Shimmy, shimmy, yay, shimmy, yay, shimmy, ya. Drank. Swa la la la. Master lyricist. I think I've said this before uh, on stream or on a video, but my favorite song lyric of all time uh, comes from Sean Kingston's Eeny Meeny Miny Mo Lover, in which he speaks thusly. <clears throat> she indecisive. She can't decide. Thank you, Sean Kingston. Egg! Thanks, Glonathan. Can always count on you. Oh my god, you're running a dole. I need to clear out the poop. I need to clear out the poop because it's bad. What about lunge? Yo, get out of there. You're gonna eat your own poop again, and that's what screws you over. Get out there and go live in a sea of nutrient. See, look. Boom. Munch, 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 munch. That's what you need to be doing, goofball. Snary the plop is ready for a mutation. La, 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 la. It happened again. What just happened? What keeps happening to you? It, it keeps making like sounds and then everything is gone. It's all gone again. What can someone like explain this in the comments? What's happening to lunch? This is like the 30th time it's happened. It's just he'll eat something and then it'll go and I'll check on him and his gut will be completely empty. It's not even like he's throwing up because he's not leaving behind any like half eaten food or anything. Maybe he is truly just puking. It might be the scaff that's like giving him some kind of disease that does that. I don't know, but it really bums me out to see him suffer. Okay, Chunsty, I know you look so comfortable, but you're starving. Even though you seem really uninterested in it, I am very interested in it because you need to stay alive for me. Let's make some gourds. Welcome to the good, 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 gourd zone. Pew, 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 pew. I would go there if that existed. I feel like that could be fun. You know, like King's Dominion, Hershey Park, Six Flags, Gourd Zone. La 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 la. Delete the cocoon. Snare the plup. Doesn't matter what you do from this point, you have already been, just your existence is a massive service to this world because that achievement gave me so much trouble. We're at 94% completion. We are missing only four. Once we grab spindly, flat should follow suit. And then we're just missing these two, which are both real tough, but we'll get there. We're close to the field guide. We just have a few problems. It's just the freaking like Cresselia and the dud eggs and whatnot. And we're missing one kind of food. We're missing one kind of food that we'll probably get from either flat or spindly. And then we're missing this right here, this really rare thing that comes from having Cresselia in your system. Protractor X, eat this. Just keep eating the Cresselia. Thanks, 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 thanks. Lunge, you're doing awesome. Awesome. I just want you to know that. I don't know what keeps happening to you. The scaff is all gone. The scaff is all gone. You got it out of your system. Ugh, oh, thank goodness. I don't know what that was. You have a ghost. Whomst? Dave! Hi, Dave. No, what? I was just happy about something for one moment. Oh, come on, man. I don't want... I don't have it in me. All right. Russell Bustle B is gone. Well, that's not fun for anybody. Dave, do you want to go say hi to everybody? I'm just sad. I'm gonna clean up all the dirt. I'm gonna remove the dirt. Oops, I just put it into the world. That's the opposite of what I meant to do. I wanna store all the dirt. There we go. Present. We haven't had a lot of presents. We got a computer desk, very fun, and graveyard carpet. I'm gonna be real. This fan, while hilarious, is just purely awful for my sweet boys. I hate that they have to fight a fierce gale anytime they wanna munch on a fortune cookie. What is my fortune cookie? Oh, fortune cookie. What does my fortune say? I'm gonna die alone? Cool. I wish the companies that made fortune cookies got a lot more like bold with their fortunes and started just straight up saying like, you will control a disease and never recover because that's so like intriguing and exciting you know what i mean to just be like i'm gonna get some orange chicken and then know the exact time and place of your death i'd enjoy it thanks for taking me for chinese daddy no problem son let's go ahead and crack open our fortune cookies what's your fortune say my boy i will live a life of sin also my lucky numbers are 12 and 3 dave let, no you're not allowed to freaking tussle with my sweet freaking bemo i cannot believe you all right lunge 
Your gut is literally only nutrient pellets. So that's the best I can do. Same with Protractor X. I love that you guys go at the same time every time. Soulmates. All right. After this, they'll be adults, and then we can have them breed and create the long leg super child who we will then throw back in there and get to work on oh we got so lucky that lunch is a glutton though the odds of getting another glutton are so dang low all right lunch come on down how long are your legs pretty long i mean look at these legs all these went up our front bottom leg is maxed out these are these are pretty good numbers you're putting up good numbers so that's pretty solid now let's check out protractor x again the legs did get longer yeah there we go front top leg especially up 12 percent. that's great look at those numbers awesome job now they're both adults oh my god we got a new thing chrysilia leg number is a rare effect we finally got it effects leg number oh my god it was super rare that's why you're we having trouble i guess one of them grew another leg or something that would have to be protractor x but protractor x already had six legs i thought well who knows all done you're you're all done like oh the yeah i want to save those for the next generation now you guys can live out your old age together as soulmates anyway let's breed you with each other protractor x and lunge they both turned completely orange because of the nutrient pellets all right let's create some long leg diggy dogs massive litter okay whose legs are the longest let's let's go through here your legs are really long so you're gonna go into the maybe pile your legs are pretty long you're just a big dog so it doesn't really like i think it's proportional maybe oh these are some long they're all really long man i think i'm gonna go with you i think i'm gonna go with you as our longest leg dog maybe i should have kept the simulation going for a while and then like maybe an unstable breeding thing would cause really long legs i don't know i'm just gonna go ahead and hatch our new pal fingers crossed it's a glutton we, the, the food training thing was key praising them every time they eat that was huge speaking of huge man it's just that last food now and our gut flora field guide is totally full we just need to unlock that last food so once we get whichever one of these gives us the new food my bet is spindly then this one's gonna follow suit and then we'll just have two left Ooh, we are getting down to it ladies and germs ladies and therms ladies and therms someone in my discord server uh suggested that i change the rules channel to say therms and conditions and i love it all right new pop welcome loot we're like boof okay boof boof is not a glutton boof is actually nothing in fact but every time boof eats we're gonna praise him like he deserves you know what why don't we do the same thing we did last time and and make two so like as a fail safe so if boof doesn't turn out right then we'll have another one so we're gonna have another pair of soulmates i should not say soulmates because they are siblings oopsie poo oh you're weird i think it's gonna be you you know what should we try to no i don't trust it this guy already has like really long legs digsby digsby's ready to go i love you digsby all right so we got boof and his new friend that you're already starting with all this action in here fantastic look at our happy little orange nuclear family here well we'll be nuclear once this fella hatches i mean i guess every family in wild dogs is nuclear because they're all mutants but in the in the normal sense complete the nuclear family oh your legs are really long you might actually be like the, the chosen one you have a weird leg layout three on one side one on the other i am kind of confused big burger Oops, I don't know. I wow. Did you see me just say burger and type a different word? I do that all the time. I was gonna say bridge, I think. Big burger, huge. <laughs> also only has the, the the gene we're looking for. That's awesome. Look at the happy family. Look at that. We got parents, we got children. That's so sweet. Look at them. I'm so happy. Y'all better, one of y'all better work out so I don't have to breed you with each other since you're siblings. Oh, golly. Okay. Boof. Go ahead and eat this and I'm going to praise you. There we go. Praise and pets. Yes. This is the key, as we've learned, is to, is, the, is to get them to want to eat. Digsby. Digsby, Digsby. Digsby. My favorite, favorite little boy. A little less little now. <laughs> Hmm, I'll miss you when you're gone, Digsby. But for now, you're here and you're here to stay. Expel. And we're right back in. That was actually clean. All right, Big Burger Huge is not really doing much. Boof is kind of just slumbering. Can you eat this and then I'll praise you for it because I really want to get on that. Okay, you're gonna eat, you're gonna eat, you're gonna eat. You can stop if you're full. You can stop if you're full. Okay, I don't want you to puke up all your fun jeans. Oh, you have a pattern. It was just hidden because it's the exact same color as your body. Fantastic. Good work, Boof. Okay, I'm really, I'm really happy with the progress we're making on Spindly. Oh, you're about to puke, aren't you, Big Burger Huge? Damn it, that's really bad. Oh, wait, you're a glutton. <gasps> praise oh shoot i was too late i should have praised you while you were eating oh yeah you got food in your tom okay eat this 
and then I'm gonna praise you the second you're done. We got another glutton. No, I'm not praising you for barking. I'm trying to praise you for eating. He's too high energy. Yeah, he's loud and high energy. Shoot, man. I was trying to praise him for eating. That's awesome, though. We got another glutton. That is fantastic. That is huge. That is big burger. Huge. Am I right? Probably. And I'm gonna vacuum the flow. Flamingo's hungry. Well, then freaking leave. Like, I seriously, I, like, I'm shocked I have to say this every time. I need to start praising you for eating. So you'll actually feed yourself, goofball. Except for you, I'll be super sarcastic about it. Oh, good job. Oops, I just threw him away. Sorry. That was out of character. What? Is someone... Oh, you're just howling for fun. I thought someone was in the process of dying. Woo! All right, Snary. Go ahead. God, that scared me. That snared me, am I right? <laughs> Project R X? You're freaking... Okay, the dog den is actually kind of not great for this. You're supposed to never get hungry. You're like... You love to eat. Because I made you love to eat. That is what I trained you to love. Go ahead and eat. Okay, Boof is ready to go. Before you go, eat this really quick. Fantastic. And I'm going to praise you and I'm going to pet you. And he thinks it was for sitting. Okay, well... Go ahead. Oh my god, wait. Did you just did you just do it? Praise? Damn it. It is so hard to get him to like eating because he just does so much. Okay. We're gonna do it immediately. The second you eat this, I'm gonna praise you. The second you're done. Praise. Choke on food. God damn it. I didn't know he was about to barf. Ugh. Okay, we can try again because you choking and vomiting actually freed up some space in your tummy. Stop digging. You're so annoying. You were supposed to be the chosen one, but you don't do anything I want you to. I don't know what that was about. Finally, eat. I hope someone's not dying because I just closed out a window without reading it. Capsule. What's in it? Skeleton wall. I hope someone doesn't die and I'm not there for it. Okay, well, Big Burger Huge is going to go ahead and mutate now. All right, Snary. Snary the plop. What, what, what hath you done? I really love this tail. Not much. As long as the tail's there, I'm pleased. All right, Boof. Please tell me you made strides. Kinda. Yeah, totally, 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 totally. These bars are all up. That's awesome. Okay, great job. Now, Boof, we're gonna enter phase two. Whoa, that was a lot. Okay, we're gonna enter phase two. You're going in the cocoon chamber now, and that's where you shall remain. No, get out of here. Lunge, you're gonna eat all the cocoons. You're past your prime. When are you gonna understand that? Big burger, huge. Tell me, please tell me you also made strides. Yes, all these numbers are up. Look at the, look, we're, we're, our bars are improving. You are going to join your bro in the cocoon zone. And now you guys will stay there. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Boof, eat this cocoon. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna praise you and I'm gonna praise you. Look, they both went up a bit for eating and food. Awesome, we're getting better. I wish I didn't throw away all my freaking cocoons by accident, man. Oh no, they're all in there, aren't they? It happened again. Who, who just barfed? It was Big Burger Huge. It's all the gluttons. They keep throwing up. That's so bad. Okay, now freaking Big Burger Huge has to go back out and eat more nutrient pellets. Damn, dude. Why does this keep happening? Okay, just eat the nutrient pellet and then I'm gonna praise you. Clump Thursday is getting old. Everything is going wrong. But unfortunately, I'm gonna have to end this one here. I feel like we're making significant progress on the Spindly Project. We have four very orange dogs who are ready to impress. Oh, good job. Praise, praise. I praise you for sneezing. I'm done with this. I'm ending the video. And you just threw up. I need a break. I'm so frustrated with these freaking dogs. Well, thank you so much for tuning in. As always, I really appreciate it. And I'll be back next Wednesday with another installment of Wobble Dogs. Drop a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you in a few- You did it again! You threw up! Stop throwing up! I'm so, like, any developed scaff. I don't understand what's going on. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in a few days. Goodbye. Goodbye.